सो हेलो गाइज वेलकम बैक टू द न्यू वीडियो इन टू डेज वीडियो आई विल गाइड यू विद हाउ यू कैन एनेबल हाइपर वी ऑन विंडोज इलेवन होम बाई डिफॉल्ट दिस फीचर इज नॉट अवेलेबल फॉर होम यूजर्स टू चेक इट क्लिक ऑन द सर्च बटन नाउ सर्च फॉर विंडोज फीचर प्रेस एंटर टू ओपन इट एज यू कैन सी हेयर हाइपर वी इज नॉट अवेलेबल Just to be sure that my laptop is on Windows 11 Home, let's open the search bar again. Now type the command winwar and press Enter. As you can see, it says Windows 11 Home. There is a workaround by which you can enable Hyper V on Windows 11 Home, and in this video, I will guide you with that. So this video is divided into two parts. Step one: Enable virtualization on your system. So for this. First click on the search bar. Now search for task manager and open it. Now on the left side, click on performance. Now click on CPU. As you can see here, virtualization is set to disabled. So first, you will have to enable it. So for this, you will have to open your BIOS menu. So first of all, press Windows plus I key on your keyboard to open settings. Now on the left side, click on system. scroll down and then click on recovery next to advanced startup click on restart now click on restart now again so now this will restart your system now on this screen click on troubleshoot after this click on advanced options now click on uefi firmware settings After this, click on restart. So now this will open BIOS on your system. This screen will be different for different brands. Here, click on the advanced mode. After this, click on the advanced tab. Now, click on this drop-down menu and select enabled. After this, click on this drop-down menu next to VTD and select enabled. Now click on save and exit and then click on save changes and exit. Click on okay. Now this will restart your system. After this sign into Windows. After this open task manager again. Now click on performance and then click on CPU. Now as you can see virtualization is set to enabled. Step 2 run batch script. Now once you have enabled virtualization create a batch script to enable hyper v and run it so for this click on the search bar search for notepad and open it after this paste this code you will find its link in the description after this click on this file button and then click on save as now set the file name as hyper v dot bat now set the location as desktop and then click on save now as you can see the batch file is saved here right click on it and then click on this option in the uac prompt click on yes now this will start running the batch script it may take around 10 to 15 minutes for the process to complete at the end press y to restart your pc now once your system restarts it will enable hyper v on windows 11 home to check it click on the search bar and then type hyper v now you will see hyper v manager over here press enter to open it i hope you find this video useful and if you do Then don't forget to like the video and subscribe our channel.